Welcome to a study guide for the distant learner. My name is Nora Omomelo. I'll be taking you through Module 2, Unit 5. That's on study strategies. Determine a study format that works for you. This unit on study strategy is designed to help you find an effective study pattern that will be most suitable for you. In essence, it will guide you towards choosing a study strategy that will work for you. In determining this, you must take into cognizance your own special conditions or peculiarities. Finding the learning style that suits you. To succeed academically, you need to be proactive and study well. You should be able to figure out the learning style that will suit you best and enhance productivity. To succeed at effective study, you should work out a learning style that will be good for you. And to be able to do this, you must try and discover the type of learner that you are. So what type of learner are you? We all cannot learn the same way. Some people are visual learners, some auditory, some are verbal, while others are tactile or kinesthetic learners. Visual learners. This group of people study and remember better with pictures, graphics, diagrams, etc. They have a preference to what they see. Auditory or oral learners. Oral learners will remember what they heard better than what they see. It is much easier for this group of learners to pick up information through listening and speaking. Verbal learners. People that find themselves in this group study better through reading and writing. You can be seen as a verbal learner if using words in writing and speech comes easy to you. Tactile or kinesthetic learner. This group of learners will prefer physical activity. They learn by doing things. You might be a tactile or kinesthetic learner if you like crafts or enjoy using your hands to make things. Methods approaches and techniques for effective study. Different people find different methods effective at helping them learn. So, take a look at some of the different study methods and choose what will work for you. Note taking and note making. Learning things by heart. Learning with others. Explaining to others. Learning through audio or video. Learning by doing or learning by deducing. Finding the right study strategies. How can you do this? Number one, pick a place and time. Find that time and place that is most comfortable and convenient for you. Study daily. If you study a little every day, you will be continually reviewing things in your mind and avoid last minute cramming. Plan your time. You can set alarms, use daily planners, or make a to-do list. You can also set time to spend on each task. Review and revise. Go through what you have studied in class and what you have studied on your own time. This will help you understand and remember better. Take breaks. In between your study, take breaks so that you are not unnecessarily fatigued. Ask for help. And if you require help or aid in any form, do ask for it. Stay motivated. It helps to keep your goals and reasons in mind. Participate in class discussions. In these discussions, you get the opportunity to contribute, ask questions and improve on your understanding. Plan for your examination. Study well and be ready. Don't leave things for the last moment. We have come to the end of Module 2. Please refer to your course material for further reading. Thank you.